This workpiece represents the type of part programmed and machined in the majority of CNC shops around the world every day. In this video, I'll demonstrate how this everyday workpiece can be quickly and easily programmed using Kipware T conversational software. All done using fill in the blank type forms and requiring no CAD and no CAD experience. For a workpiece like this, when design work is not required, shop floor programming with Kipware Conversational is the smarter choice, allowing you to dump the CAD and start creating G-code right away. The Kipware Conversational programming concept includes the creation of cycles for each machining operation required to machine the workpiece complete. Cycles are created using conversational or fill-in-the-blank type forms and each time a cycle is created it is added to the tree. When all the cycles have been added to the tree the main program module will link them all together into one program that can be sent to the CNC for machining. In this example we will use four cycles facing, OD roughing, OD finishing, and OD grooving. We'll start the programming process first giving the program a name. In our first operation, we'll face the part. We'll complete the fill in the blank form and then hit create program. The facing cycle is then added to the tree. To rough and finish turn the part, we'll use the Kipware T simple turning menu. First, we'll define the two elements that make up the diameters and the lengths. Once we've defined the elements, we can then define the cutting parameters. With the cutting parameters defined, we'll give the program a name, and now we can decide how we want to machine the part. The menu gives us powerful options. We can rough turn or rough face. We can finish turn and finish face. We can even create a can cycle program or a long hand G-code program. In this instance, we're going to select rough turning and select create program, long hand G-code. and the rough OD cycle is added to the tree. To finish the OD, rather than creating a completely new cycle, I'm first going to copy the rough OD cycle, then open it back up in the conversational menu. Turn off the rough turning and turn on the finish turning and then create program. So now I've created a completely new cycle to finish the part with just a couple of inputs. At any time during the programming process, I can look at the toolpath for one of the cycles or all of the cycles using the included Kipware TP. Kipware TP will allow me to quickly and easily plot the program to confirm the toolpath. For the final operation, we'll use the OD Pulley Groove menu to create the cycle for the groove. When all the inputs are completed, select Create Program and the groove is added to the tree. To confirm the program, again, we'll use Kipware TP, we'll use the DXF file of the part as the stock model, and we'll plot the toolpath over the stock model. To confirm the program. With all the cycles now created, it's time to create the main program where we'll link all the cycles to tool calls and create one program that we can send to the machine. We'll select operation number one, tool number one, and we'll select two cycles for this tool. First we'll face the part and then we'll rough the OD with the same tool. We'll select operation number two, tool number two, and we'll select to finish the OD. Operation number three, we'll select the OD groove. We'll give the program a number, select the post, and then hit create G-code. Kipware T will then go through and add the tool calls and link each of the cycles to those tool calls, creating one program that we can send to the machine to machine the part complete. For a workpiece like this, when design work is not required, 
Shop floor programming with Kipware Conversational is the smarter choice, allowing you to dump the CAD and start creating G-code right away.